What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? This is the student master teacher, Mr. I Stay Woke, Chris Monroe, and I'm right back at you with another real estate video. I got a question today that came out of the Woke Real Estate Investors Group, a free Facebook group right on Facebook. Check it out, Woke Real Estate on Facebook. So here's the question we got. Let's see what we have here. We got a question from Earl McRae, a new member in the group, welcome, asks, can anyone explain what a turnkey rental is? Chris, you use this expression in your video, making real estate calls while in self-isolation in St. Louis. So the question is what a turnkey rental is? Great question, Earl. So for a turnkey rental, it's really simple. It basically means that someone that say a doctor or lawyer, someone who is, may not be a person that's into real estate right now, and uh, they want to get into real estate, but they don't necessarily want to fix and flip, uh, do wholesale deals, or really be in the business. A person with a bunch of money may be stacked up and they want to buy property and invest their money or invest and protect themselves from capital gains or invest to get out of the stock market. The stock market has been crashing for a few days. I guess it bounced back, but that's another story. But basically, if you want to put your money into real estate without actually working real estate, that would be a turnkey type property. Now, a lot of people may say some things are turnkey, but it may be uh, a little bit more than what they say. So when I say turnkey, when I do it, I typically, uh, if I sell a property, I want it truly turnkey, meaning no property management, no maintenance, no repairs. All you do is collect rent and pay your mortgage, something like that. Now, other people may do it, but they may say turnkey. But they can mean something totally different, but basically, the term turnkey just means that you don't have to do any work. You can just jump into the deal, make money, make a passive cash flow, invest your money, not necessarily be an employee of real estate, a worker of real estate, a full-time investor, just more of a passive investor. So hopefully that helps you out. If you have any other questions, let me know. And like I said, follow me on all social media outlets at Chris Monroe STL. Do what you do. Be who you be, and I'll see you before you see me.